So now let's see how we can utilize the pick noise effect inside of GIMP. So to apply the pick noise, you need to go around under filters and then you need to go under noise. And over here, you can see that pick is an option. So if I were to go around and zoom in, you can see that this is how the noise looks. So if I were to go around and decrease out the randomness, then you can see that the pixel is there. But if I were to go around and increase the randomness, then you can see that it simply supples the pre-existing pixels right here to create the noise right here, as if you're looking through a glass right here. If I were to go around and change around the seed, then this is how it looks, as you can see right here, just like this. So you can go around and change it out. Of course, you can utilize the blending mode right here, just like this, to go around and then blend it, but usually it doesn't make a lot of difference. So over here, you can see the before and you can see the after right here. And you can see the split view for the before and after just like this as well. And if you want to apply it, you can go around and simply press OK. And that is how you can apply pick noise inside of GIMP. So I hope you guys learn something as always. And as always, please like, comment, share and subscribe.